I have a lot of regrets. No regrets, no regrets, no pardon crying over yesterday. Hey! Oh god, god, you know. What's happening in my nose? It's gonna itch. I'm just gonna like hide the bra. I don't think the bra is necessary to be involved. I can't! Remember that advert with the Cadbury's kids and it was like, mm, Mm -mm 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 -mm. I used to wish I was one of them. Hi guys, it's Demi. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you're all having a fabulous day. I'm going to do a video which I'm really excited for. I've had this video on my to-do list for ages and it's just been like shoved to the side, shoved to the side again and again and again. But I actually think it's quite a good idea. For today's video, I am pissing myself off. So for today's video, I have compiled a pile of clothes that I've bought at some point in time and I kind of regret buying them. Well, I do regret buying them because they've sat in my wardrobe and been worn once, if that. Some of them have definitely been worn more than once, but you get the idea, you get the gist. I don't reach for these clothes as much as I kind of would have expected to when I first bought them. What I thought I would do for this video is try the items on, but try and style them and get ideas and outfits together before I just decide that these clothes aren't for me and I either resell them or give them away because I've at one point liked these items and they've always stayed in the wardrobe when I've done my clear outs for a reason but I don't reach for them when I'm getting ready in the morning so it's kind of that I don't like these clothes I regret buying it but I don't have it in us to get rid of it there's something that's making us keep the items but I don't know what it is so today we're going to go through and we're going to try and style the items so that I have cute idea outfits ready for when I want to wear the items and then if after making this video if in a few months time when I do another wardrobe clear out they're still there and I haven't worn them they have to go they have to go at that point but we're going to give them the benefit of the doubt and we're going to try and style the items and I'm going to talk about why I don't reach for them why I kind of regret buying them and I bet you we'll all have items in our wardrobe that we we'll regret buying so this is your sign to have a look at the items you regret buying or that you don't reach for and see if you can style it make it work and see if you can reignite the spark of when you first bought the item of what made you like it without further let's style some items that I regret buying First things first, damn the rulers. First things first, every single pair of jeans that I own, which is four pairs, have made it into the I regret buying you pile. <sighs> jeans, I just, the thing is, I feel like it's compulsory to own jeans. I need to own jeans in case a jean occasion pops up. I never ever want to wear jeans, I never reach for jeans, I can't style jeans. I feel like they don't look nice on my body. So the first pair of jeans I've got on is this pair. Oh, I think they're meant to be mum style jeans. They're in a dark blue. But I know why I don't reach for them now that I've got them on. I just don't think they're that flattering. I don't know what pair of jeans are flattening because for years and years and years I wore skinny jeans. I wouldn't go near skinny jeans now. I don't like them, they're uncomfortable and I just wouldn't wear them. I thought mum jeans would be quite flattering but I always find I get this bagginess at the knee which I hope the camera is showing you but the jeans are just baggy now these actually I could downsize these are quite big on us now um I might sell these oh I think I'm gonna sell these because I never reach for them but it's like what is happening at the knee and this has happened I feel like since I bought them that's why I never reach for them I like how high-waisted they are though that's a positive they are quite high-waisted um, now I've just got this like black little off the shoulder top on. This isn't an, this is an all right outfit. Like every day this is okay, but these jeans I just I don't know. I just don't find them very flattering. Like I'm like what's flattering about this? Like you're not giving us what I want. And I mean to be fair, they're a very very comfy jean. They're really soft. Like like they're a squat jean. <laughs> I've just ripped them. Oh! <laughs> ripped the fucking jeans. <laughs> they're not a squat jean because the 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 ripped. Well, well. <laughs> Fuck me. Okay. Oh yeah. They're ripped. Oh yeah. Easy access, just kidding. Regret buying them because they're not a squat jean. <laughs> Oops. Okay, not selling these. These are going in the bin. Stupid jean! <laughs> oh no. <sighs> wow. Okay, 
Right, that's all right. You live and learn. Don't squat in jeans. I don't even like them anyway. From ASOS. ASOS, I kind of expected a bit better than that, to be honest. Fuck off, look at that. <laughs> they weren't even tight on us. Don't squat in a jean then. They're from ASOS, wow. Okay. Next. <laughs> I feel, what the fuck, how do you recover from that? How, how do you recover from that? We'll go for another pair of jeans, okay? So, I bought these jeans. <laughs> these jeans on a video that you might have seen i did a video where i went to shops that i hate these are from matalan and i paid 35 quid for these and i got them in a regular 18 right and i tried them on in the shop when i did that video and i really 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 liked them oh wait okay oh my god okay why am i not reaching for these there that was it okay so I don't know if it's the length or if I need to downsize slightly because I've tried these on a few times and the reason I've not reached for them is this extra, I think they're a bit long for us, right? And if I get me mum to take these up, oh. Because, right, they're a bit baggy. I could downsize, right? But if I get my mum to take these up, I feel like these could be cute. Do you know what I mean? Like they're really soft. That's why I bought them because they're so soft. They don't feel like a jean. They feel so comfortable to wear. But I just feel like there's extra material. That, that's the length I need them. But then you can't go out like that, can you? So I feel like I just need to get me mum to take them up a bit. And then these are actually really pretty jeans. Because they're not mum jeans. So I feel like they're just wide leg. Ah, okay. I do like these. I do see why I bought these. I just, they just sit in my wardrobe and every morning I'm like, you're not a bit of me. But they actually are really cute. What do we think? Can I style it? See, you could style it. Like, I've styled it with this top, but then I also have a top that I regret buying that I'm going to put on now because I feel like... Okay. This I bought from Primark. As you can see, I've never worn it. It's got the label on it. I bought it not that long ago, or it was a while ago. I don't know when I fucking bought it, but it was not that long ago. It was a while ago. I don't know. It's an XL, right? But it's in like a swimsuit feel material. And I know why I don't like this. Because every time I've put it on, I feel like because of the material it is, it shows every single bra that I have lines. Eh, uh, that's it, man. It's like, it's every time I put it on. Okay, these jeans actually could do with a belt. But every time I put it on, it's like it shows my bras because it's like tightened in so I need to like try and hide the bra because I don't really like my bra strap showing and then I just feel like you can see everything like look I just don't know like I want to love it I love the colour but I just feel like because of its swimsuit material or is this quite a nice outfit I don't know if I'm actually lying here. Nah, I wouldn't wear this. It's just like every bit shows up and it it's like it clings to you a little bit much. And it's like how I wear, like give us a bit of room. Like I like things clinging to us, but usually when they're in like a cottony material, you, you can't see everything. Or I don't know if it's just because it's like red, but I just feel like it shows and exposes everything. Like, you know, me boob lumps, it shows, not me lumps, but like me double boob things. Like all the lining of me bra, the lace, like everything is on display. I don't know why. I just feel like I need to come to a conclusion where all of this isn't shown. I need a plain bra with nothing on it. And then I feel like it would work. I quite like this um, denim and red contrast though. Actually, I've seen that hack where people put a shoelace in the back of their... Um, jeans and tie it I feel like I need to try that because I feel like if these jeans were like cinched in a bit oh my god look at that that would look pretty wouldn't it mm. these ones are lettuce hem ones from Pet & Co see I do like these these are the ones I reach for if any the most but I still just don't reach for jeans love these ones when I bought them because of the lettuce hem but I feel like they're a mom jean yeah, I think they are. You can use this to like cinch it in. Oh yeah, but then it like... Oh, 
feel like I'm cinching it in a bit much. Tuck you in. Right. No, see, so these are too baggy. I feel like these ones just are, I need to downsize because, oh no, I don't. Oh, they're actually all right, aren't they? Oh my God, what is wrong with this? I feel like there may be a little bit too much material and I'm getting the baggy knee issue again, which I feel like, I like the style, I love the lettuce hem. I love the little fabric belt, even though I don't like fabric belts. I like this fabric belt because it cinches us in. But I just think they're not that flattering. And every time I put them on, I think I'm just like, I don't know. Just, I feel like a nice, smaller little fit would have been better. So I feel like these are a regret. I'm not going to get rid of them though, I'm going to hold on to them because I actually do kind of like them. <laughs> what is happening? Okay, no, I do actually kind of like them style it with like a little top like this or like something you know but all the jeans I have are like blue don't feel like light blue that's kind of what I go for right wait there right these jeans that I have these are from PLT they're in a size 20 I've had these ones for ages you know but it's the knees on these that I know I don't like oh my god guys go in your wardrobe and try the stuff on you never reach for because what is happening here I'm actually liking the majority of them. I just, do they look too baggy where they're like unflatterers? Or do we think they're actually all right? Okay, I feel like these are okay. Let's get another top on. I've put this in my regret buying because I've never worn it since I bought it. It's um, from Primark. I got it in a 2XL. I don't even think I've tried it on, you know. It was £8. And I never reach for it because of the colour. Now, say these jeans now, right? When I'm standing like that, look how baggy they look. See, they are just, I mean, do I stand like this in the day? No, but like, <laughs> I can't make my mind up. Do I like the jeans or not? I don't know. Back to the top. I've never wore this because of the colour. It's hot pink. Do I ever wear hot pink? No. I got it because it was long arm and I needed tops for when me and Sean Went to the local pub and I just felt like I was wearing the same top again and again and again. And I am a long arm top type of girl. But. That is horrific. Oh my god no. Okay. That's obviously why. It's the neck needs to be here but my boobs are too saggy to sit where the top is saying like your boobs should sit I think Ugh, it, um. mm, I don't think I like this oh this is weird it's because the neck's like so droopy where I need it to cover my bra I feel like my tits need to be up here oh god no okay yeah I regret this this is horrible black tits I feel like it could work like if you had a little like, boob area but with me, it just does not work. Nah. Okay, yeah, this is a big regret. I regret this. Right, pants. I have a black pair of tailored pants, which I never reach for. They're from Misguided. They're in a size 20. And I think they're a bit short. Okay, them jeans I'm going to keep a hold of. You can stay, just not in my frame. Okay, this top is horrific, see? The mesh bit now is just exposing my full bra. Oh, actually, they're not short. Oh, I think I like them. Oh, I think I do. Okay, Demi, wear your fucking clothes. No, these are cute. Okay, how would I style these, though? This is the thing. Tailored trousers, I do struggle to style. I feel like I've gone basic, but if I shove on a little black top, this, I don't regret buying this little black top, but I just bought it to style some items okay so we'll go for the black pants a little black top yeah that's all right and then like if i'm going out oh i'll show you the jacket i regret buying so my man keeps saying oh if you don't want that jacket i'll have it but i can't get rid of it there's something about it but this jacket i got from nasty gal and it's a love hate relationship like i feel like i like the look of it aesthetically but then i don't think it's my vibes what is in here i have been looking for that everywhere 
haven't. I just thought of it a few times and thought that went missing. I like this lip gloss. But I just feel like this jacket does absolutely not for me. Like, it doesn't suit us. It boxes us out. I feel like a biker, which is not me vibe at all. Yeah, so I feel like I might give this to me mum now because it's just, I don't feel like it does absolutely anything for us. And, I mean, I know this is a very basic outfit, but, like, with a black top, I could even wear, like, you know, you could... Yeah, like, I could make these work. Okay, I'm sorry. These are cute. Right, I have another pair of tailored trousers. These ones I actually have never worn. I got them from ASOS, the brand... I'm not really sure. But me and Jess tried these on on a video I did with Jess. They actually... They're a bit long on us, but they actually have a tie at the bottom, so you could tie them. Ooh. Put the full outfit on before we whinge. Yeah, okay, they're a bit... They're a bit big. Oh, well, my outfit idea was, I felt like this night, nice, I don't regret this, but I felt like this nice little, I have sports bras that I can wear with this top where it doesn't do this. Oh my God, this is horrific. Nah, I can't style these. I don't know what the fuck to do. They looked atrocious. They're going. It turned out to be a good video because all of the jeans, apart from the ones that split, but all of the other jeans, why am I not wearing them? Like, I need to just style them. But there's items in here that I do regret buying and need to go. And that is going to conclude this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. I hope you liked the way that I tried to style the items and see if they were actually worth keeping or not. If you would like to see more videos like this where I play around with clothes that I already own, let us know by giving this one a thumbs up, subscribe down below, and without further ratatata, I'll see you all shortly for another one. Bye!